I, you two, and uh, friends, family. My name is Lincoln Williams, certified CNA. That's what it's called, in short, CNA. Uh, I just want to talk real quick about COVID. Uh, we need to be educated, we need to be mindful of it to know what it's all about, as far as I can tell you. Well, I'm a survivor of COVID. Not an easy thing. And I wouldn't wish my worst enemy should have it by any means because uh, it's uncomfortable for number one. It leaves you pain, it stresses you out, especially if you live alone. Uh, it's not an easy thing. Um, way back in um, last year, around this time, um, I, 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 I was at work and a patient of mine had it, but I, I didn't know. We didn't know much about it at that time. Uh, the patient was just coughing, and I realized that he coughing, and I, I said to the nurse, um, is there any cold or cough syrup, any medicine for this man for his coughing? And she gave him something for it. And after giving him it, the cough and you know it relieved him at some point. Uh, that was that day and then another day. Uh, he coughed and he coughed on me and I still didn't know that it was so I just think it was something regular. And for some reason I said, oh, you know, I'm going to take him out of bed because I was trying for him not to have a pneumonia. And it, it was too late at that time because the next day I heard uh, that after I went home, that he had gone to the hospital. Then the next thing I heard was he got the result from 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 the hospital that he have the COVID. So I get tested and after that I found out I have the COVID. So that's where I get it. So you know I get some real Jamaican remedies like ginger, uh, turmeric garlic, uh, apple cider vinegar, and all those things, you know, we just get them together. And I quarantine for 14 days. And uh, in the midst of that, um, I, I noticed I started to have shorter breath from just the bathroom to my uh, living hall. It, it was too short to tell me that something is wrong. So I had to call 911. And then, when they come and get me, I I was in the hospital. Then they found out that I have pneumonia along with the COVID. And, you know, I was treated there at the St. Francis Hospital. And for, I was there for like three days. And out of that, you know, I get to learn, I see how you've been treated and all of that. In the midst of this, um, after recover and everything, um, there, there was this author, um, Tim Shear, said if we want to come up with a story or to just tell what we've been through. Um, in the midst of that, yes, I I, I, I was asked by a, a teacher at 1199, Lori Tishla. She was my maths English teacher over there and all that. So, you know, she encouraged me to 
write an article. The name of the book is Care Under COVID. And my article is my experience. It was a rough one. You, you at times you can't sleep, you lose your appetite, you're smelling, you're tasting, everything is gone. You know, and it's not an easy thing. So let us all wear a mask because that's what they said. That can help us wash our hands as many times as you can. Um, try to sanitize. Be careful of the places that you go. You touch these things. Don't put your hand at your face, your nose, and all of that. Be careful. And as I said, you don't want this for your worst enemy because it's not an easy thing. I had a co-worker that had it and within a week, God bless his soul, he, he died. You know, so some might make it, some won't, some, you know, but as I'm saying, <clears throat> let us all be careful, know what we are doing. Have a peaceful day. God bless you.